Today we are going to see how we can perform a firmware upgrade procedure of our Iris Fire Panel. It is important to remember that this procedure must be done only in case it is absolutely necessary. Here is what we need in order to be able to do the upgrade procedure. Installer, third level access to the panel, PC with Proste software installed, micro USB cable and the firmware version file that we apply to the configuration. We suggest you to read your panel with Proste software and save the TDF file before doing the firmware upgrade in order to have your panel's configuration because after upgrade you will have to do a full reset of the panel with the jumper to factory defaults and all programming will be lost. Enter access level 3, the default code is 3333, System Maintenance Software Revision Screen. Connect the iris panel to the PC with the USB cable. In a few seconds the panel will be recognized from your PC as a removable device. Drag or copy paste the upgrade tool file into the removable device screen. Eject the removable device by pressing the right button on it. Do not eject the device from the taskbar. Wait a few seconds and then unplug the USB cable and then power off the panel. Put the reset jumper and then power on the panel again. A calibration screen will appear. Follow the instructions on the screen. After you finish the calibration, remove the reset jumper. If the upgrade procedure is successful, we will see the new version in the following system menu. Now we can write back the configuration file that we saved at the beginning of the procedure. 